Greetings and welcome to another Pokemon 2019 or Pokemon Journeys the Series episode preview discussion. This time I'm talking about the preview for episode 108, so let's get to it. In episode 108, Ash's Greninja will return to the anime. Ash will reunite with Greninja and Ash's Lucario will meet Greninja. Lucario will end up becoming stronger because of Greninja. Now, I already made the two videos on this episode. I made the first one about a month ago because the title for this episode was revealed back then. And I made the second video about two weeks ago, since this episode was shown quite extensively in a special preview that was aired at around the same time that I made the video. But as usual, even though I already talked about the episode in question in previous videos, the actual preview of the episode reveals some new information that warrants a discussion. Therefore, the episode is worth revisiting in a preview discussion, which is what I will do in this video. I will still leave links to the previous videos on episode 108 in the description below and at the end of this video, so that you can go watch those videos if you haven't already, since those videos have some information that this video does not. So, let's get to it, shall we? Now, initially, I thought that in episode 108, Ash would run into Greninja by chance, and Ash would take advantage of this by letting Lucario train with Greninja. The special preview that showed this episode then revealed that Greninja and Lucario would face the roots of negative energy that pose a threat to the Kalos region. So I figured that Greninja and Lucario would not train together. Instead, they will battle together and, during said battle, Greninja will teach a thing or two to Lucario and, or, Lucario will learn a thing or two from Greninja, meaning that Lucario getting stronger is not the main objective. However, the actual preview of episode 108 reveals that Ash actually decides to go see Greninja, because he wants Lucario to get stronger. At the end of episode 107, Ash received a notification informing him that his next World Tronation series battle will be a promotion match against Raihan. And in the preview for episode 108, Ash says I am finally going to have my Masters 8 promotion match. Golden says you are battling Raihan, right? Lucario then talks. I guess that Lucario is saying I wanted to battle, or I am ready to battle. And Ash says if we are going to win, then we need to get stronger. And to do this, let's go see Greninja. So Ash chooses to go see Greninja so that Greninja can help Lucario get stronger. Presumably because Ash recognizes that Greninja and Lucario are both capable of feeling aura and of using aura to connect with Ash, which makes them all stronger. And since Greninja has more experience, Ash knows that Greninja can help Lucario. I love that Ash is the one that will actively seek Lucario and their reunion won't be by chance, though I think, and I am not trying to undermine Lucario or the rest of Ash's Pokemon Journeys team, but I think that since Ash knows that he needs more power in order to defeat Raihan, Ash could just ask Greninja to join his team again, even if it is just for this one battle. But this would take the focus away from Lucario and the other Pokemon in Ash's current team, which is why it won't happen. And perhaps it would be too much if Ash gets to use Greninja again. But boy would it be awesome. But yeah, it's cool that Ash decides to seek Greninja out so that Lucario can get stronger with Greninja's help. The preview does show Lucario and Greninja linking auras, and it also shows Ash and Mega Lucario connected via aura, attacking it together which is something that they already did in the battle against B in episode 86. But surely, in episode 108, they will learn to do this better and more often. Now one big question that I had and still have is, will we see Greninja transform into Ash Greninja in this episode? Well, the preview does not provide an answer to this. Greninja is seen using a giant water shuriken, which is one of the trademarks of Ash Greninja. But Greninja is clearly not transformed here. So maybe we won't see Ash Greninja in this episode, which is unfortunate. I guess that it does make sense since it would probably be difficult for Ash to link his aura with two Pokemon at once, especially if both Pokemon are to battle at the same time. 
But who knows, the special preview did show Ash and Greninja in a dark blue void, which suggests that they are going to connect in some way, so there is still hope. Especially since this is the same dark blue void where Greninja is seen using the giant water shuriken. Again, I doubt that Greninja will rejoin Ash's team, because one, Ash would be too overpowered. Second, Ash normally does not have all the Pokémon join his new team, unless it is a very special case, like a Pokémon League or Charizard in Unova. Third, Greninja was released to deal with the roots of negative energy in the Kalos region, which are still around, so Greninja still has a job to do. Though you would think that after all this time, the Kalos region would be free of roots, but I guess that there are just too many roots or Greninja has not been able to get rid of all of them, because it's working alone or something like this. You would think that Squishy and the C2 would be helping Greninja, but who knows. Speaking of which, I wonder if we will see Squishy and C2 in this episode. If I had to guess, I would say that yes. So yeah, I don't think that Greninja will rejoin Ash, but I would not mind being wrong on this front. Also, I guess that the writers are in a Kalos slash XY mode now, since we got Clement and Bonnie in episodes 103 and 104. We got Serena in episode 105 and we will get Greninja in episode 108. You would think that the Pokemon X and Y remakes are on the way, but of course, this is not the case. But yeah, that's everything I have for you in this video. Episode 108 will surely be amazing and I definitely can't wait to watch it. Episode 108 will air on April 29. As usual, once it airs, I will upload a video review for it as soon as possible. So please look forward to it. But that's the video, as always. Leave your own thoughts down in the comments below, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did and would like to see more like it, then please consider subscribing to my channel. I love Pokemon and I love making videos on both the anime and the games. Also, please consider clicking the links on screen so that you can check out more videos like this right away. Thank you very much for watching and let's meet again in the next video.